Alright everyone, welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Unity. Today we're going to be doing our very first social club mission at one of our cafes. It's actually the cafe closest to our main cafe over here. It's basically at the other side of the uh, of the island. But uh, yeah, without any further ado, let's get it. Wait, before I actually get started, these missions, uh, apparently I, I, I look some up. Just to uh, just to see you know this curiosity of mine to see of like how long they are and stuff like that. They're not too long. They don't really involve much action. It's just basically uh, go find this or if they need you to attack someone, you go attack them. Uh, so I'm thinking of not adding really commentary to most of the you know Paris stories, murder mysteries, uh, social club missions. I'm only gonna be focusing with the commentary main missions, uh, the heists, you know, and other ones that I think I see fit, I guess. But, uh, yeah, you know, maybe sometimes in a while I'm gonna, like, bin to, like, one of these, uh, missions, murder mysteries and stuff like that, and, uh, you know, I'll do some commentary, but for most of these, I don't think it's gonna be really necessary, uh, the game itself explains it for you. Uh, alright, let's, uh, let's get started. So we have, uh, it's a level 1 mission, so it should be really easy, it's called Bridge Bridges. Assassinate 4 captains exiting tolls at the bridges to the Le De La Set. Not sure I pronounced that correctly. You see, so this is basically what it is. Um, there's really no dialogue in these type of missions. Pretty simple. I'm still going to be doing them, you know, just to uh, complete most side missions in this game. Just how I like doing in, uh, in uh, all the games I play. So I'm definitely going to keep doing these. Just not with commentary, though. So the first one should be around this area right there. We control all the You've got no choice. That lady's voice actor, the one you hear right now, she's been in the, like, series. Since I could remember since and Assassin's Creed 1, she has like this just iconic, you know, NPC voice to her. <laughs> I think she even appears in some, uh, some Assassin's Creed, uh, Valhalla NPC moments. Oh, shit. I think I'm doing pretty good. Right? This big dude is definitely uh, taking some damage. You won't get away. I was gonna say, as long as no French guards see me, I should be alright. not right there. There he is. And I'm gone. What the uh, Batman smoke bomb? Honestly, I tend to use uh, more smoke bombs in this game than I ever did in any other Assassin's Creed game. Once again, if I had the Phantom Blade, everything would be much more simple. You will pay for that! Alright, and this guy over here should be the last guy, I think. Alright, this guy over here should be the last one. Whose side are you on then? Who are you fighting for? Oh, I can ask you your hands to yourself! We control the oh. bridges. You've got no choice. Oh, no, you don't. Pay up. All right, you. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> Holy shit, he's right here. Oh, wow. A well, French guard killed him for me. I mean, I guess. <laughs> I'm dipping. I'm gone. No need for me to stay here. Oh shit. Holy shit. There's 
There's way too many royalists around here. As you guys saw right there, they're really simple, really short, self-explanatory. I don't think there's going to be a reason for me to add any commentary uh, for these type of missions. For the, uh, for the social club missions, the murder mystery missions, uh, the Paris, uh, what are they called? Paris stories. I don't think I'm going to be adding any commentary. You know, I'll pop in once in a while, but, you know, I don't think for most of these there's going to be any commentary. There's just going to be simple missions, me doing the mission without commentary. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to be in the video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll definitely see you guys next time. Peace.